Hi everyone! Welcome back to the Sweetheart Alley channel. Happy to have you back in here. I'm happy to be making another video. <gasps> Whoa! Do you hear that sound? What's that? What is that glorious music you ask? This music is by the lovely Chad Music on Twitch and the link to his music, his sound clowns will be down here. I said, did I say sound clown? I don't know. Sound cloud will be down here below if you're interested. I love the sound. We have to have it anyway. So the topic of this video is going to be kind of like why, okay, why you should stream on Twitch if it's something that you're interested in. Why you should give something a try even if you're scared. That's that's basically what we're going to be talking about today. So anyway, I did write down some ideas on this here piece of paper yesterday just to kind of, you know, keep myself organized and my thoughts organized. Um, so basically, we're going to start with this. Maybe you have anxiety. Maybe you have anxiety to do something that, you know, you might feel really passionate about, whether that's streaming on Twitch, streaming on YouTube, doing a YouTube video, playing an instrument. Uh you name it it could be anything really maybe you have anxiety about it maybe you're too scared to try it which i totally respect that um i used to be absolutely mortified to stream on twitch i would get so nervous and so anxious before my streams that sometimes i would just chicken out and i don't know i don't i don't think that's the right way to live life so now how i live my life now i'm like hmm hmm am i scared Yes, but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do it anyway, because we have one life. I think we have one life here on this earth. So you might as well make the like the freaking most of it, right? Right, right, yes, yes. So here's an example of that. Um, so I went to a Comic-Con back in 2018, I think it was 2018. I did a Len cosplay from Final Fantasy X2 and I told myself, you're gonna, you're gonna enter yourself into this contest. No, I didn't win, but I entered myself into this contest and you're gonna walk on stage. You're gonna walk on stage. Yes, it's mortifying, but you're gonna do it because you're scared. You're, I'm not gonna let you chicken out because we're gonna, we're gonna live our life to the fullest and do everything that we want to do. And that's something that I've always wanted to do. So that's what we did. <laughs> we walked on stage and I had a blast. I had a blast. I made so many friends and I knew that you know if i didn't i would look back in the future and be like i should have walked on stage that day so i did and that's kind of how I, I look at twitch now too anytime i feel scared before a stream maybe i'm scared to hit that start that start streaming button on obs and i'm like we're gonna do it anyway i close your eyes feel those good vibes and just hit start streaming because you might make someone happy today you might bring a smile to someone's face. You're gonna have a good time. You don't know what's gonna happen and it's something that you're interested in, so just jump right into it and have a good time. That's what I say, give it a try. I know you're scared, just do it. Take a deep breath, we got one life. One, one, we're here temporarily, so let's do all we can. That's what I say. Anyway, on to the next point. There's something in my eye, oh my God, I got it. <laughs> Okay, so the next thing we have is that you might potentially make someone smile or make their day. You can give someone a place to have a good time and feel safe. And I think that is honestly one of the most magical things ever. If like, okay, basically, if you don't stream, if, if that's something that you feel really passionate about, but you're not doing it, like you might, like streaming gives you a chance to reach somebody and you can bring a smile to their face. You can make their day. Maybe they're having a rough day. Maybe they feel alone. Maybe they don't have a place to fit in and you can bring that to them. And I think that's the most glorious, magical thing ever. I've had quite a few people reach out to me and you know, see how much they love the community, how alone they felt before. Um, maybe they were having a really rough day and then they, you know, like happened upon my stream and I was able to bring a smile to their face. And I think that like that is, oh <laughs> that's why i stream like to give like to reach somebody and it's just so important it's you never know who might need you you never know who who you might make smile and i just i think that's just wonderful and yeah like i want to make people happy and i know that streaming you know gives me a chance to do that and so I, what i say is you can do that too you can make someone smile you can make someone happy so maybe maybe you're kind of scared to start that stream but i think you should give it a try maybe there's someone out there that you know you're meant to be friends with and 
you're gonna meet a lot of cool cool friendly faces through the streams you're gonna give people a place to just vibe hang out chill and just have some good vibes and everything's gonna be okay everything will be okay let's see what else i have on here okay so this kind of touches on what we just talked about but you get to make friends from streaming from streaming on twitch i feel like i've made so many wonderful connections so far and i know that there's going to be so many more too and i wouldn't have even had a chance to make like half of these friends were i were i to never start streaming and i know that some of these friendships are going to last a lifetime too you know for example like i'm going to be hanging out with some of my twitch friends this summer you know if COVID all works out and I've already met some people from Twitch too. And I don't know, it's, it's very cool. Cause you never know who you're going to meet. You never know what kind of connections you're going to make. You never know if these friends that you, if these friends that you meet, are they going to stick? Like they probably will. And like, you can, you can meet people with common interest. Like I've noticed for myself in real life, you know, it might be hard to find Final Fantasy fans, but oh my goodness gracious, I have found a handful of Final Fantasy X friends from Twitch. And it's so awesome to meet people who have something in common with you like that. Cause it makes like connection and communication just like boom, 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 boom. <laughs> um, let's see, what else do we got? Okay, basically you're going to have fun playing old games and also new games. So maybe, you know, for example, me, Final Fantasy X is my favorite game of all time. And, you know, getting to stream it, doing all the super bosses, all the end game content and sharing my knowledge of one of my favorite games ever with my new Twitch friends and, you know, connecting with other people who are also interested in the game is just glorious. But also, I've also been playing um, the Legend of Zelda series, which I've never played before. And oh my goodness, I've met some fantastic friends, fantastic friends who grew up with the Legend of Zelda. And I'm having a, an absolute blast going through the series and just making so many memories. And honestly, like Legend of Zelda is amazing. I can't believe I didn't play it at all growing up. So like Twitch is also, about experience you know you can play those old games that you grew up with and share them with new friends or you can make new friends from some new games that you've never played before it's it's rather glorious if you ask me <laughs> um but yeah so you can have multiple different experiences and but share them with people who have the same interest it's very cool so kind of touching back on what we talked about in a minute ago is you never know what kind of connections you're going to make like lifelong friendships and meeting like you know you can meet these people in person and they can be like a real life friend if you trust them <laughs> um but okay so one of the coolest things about life for me is people that's my favorite thing about life meeting people and with twitch that it becomes infinitely easier especially during this time with covid so like you can really just you know, find, find people, find out what makes them tick. What are they interested in? What makes them smile? What are their likes? What are their dislikes? And really get to know, get to know people. And I think that's, it's, it's awesome. Who doesn't want to make friends and through Twitch and, you know, joining a community and you really, you're, you're going to have friendships. You're going to meet all these amazing people who have different life experiences. And it's really beautiful. I think, I think so. I hope I'm making sense. I'm just uh, kind of trying to share my perspective on how amazing Twitch is and like why you should do it. Like why, like, I don't know. It's definitely scary to try something new, but I think the Twitch is worth it. And I don't know, I'm very, very, very thankful that I started streaming and I wouldn't have it e any other way. It was definitely one of the best decisions that I've ever made. And I absolutely adore all the friends that I made. Like I freaking adore you. <laughs> And yeah, that, that's basically all I really want to talk about is, you know, like my experience on Twitch and, you know, kind of why you should do something, even if you're afraid like that, maybe that that's even more than just Twitch as well. It could be anything. It could be playing an instrument. It could be snowboarding, doing gymnastics, skateboarding, uh, singing, swimming, whatever it is, because, you know, we have one life here on this beautiful planet. This circulating up in the sky. Oh no, I just realized that my stars are off. Hold up. There we go. Vibe. <laughs> um, but yeah, circulating up in the sky. Like, so you might as well just do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Anything that you're interested in, just 
jump into it. See what happens. That's, that's my piece of advice for life. Because, you know, you can't let fear rule you. If you let fear rule you, ooh, we got a new song. <laughs> if you let fear rule you, then like, I don't know, you're probably gonna regret it. And I don't recommend that. So I say just jump in, jump in. Don't let anything stop you. You can do anything. You hear me? You can do anything. So give it a try, why not? But anyway, I'm going to go now. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. Hope that you're having a magical day. I hope that it's as equally magical as you are magical. And yeah, um, I'll see you in the next video or maybe on stream, maybe your stream, maybe my stream, maybe on Discord, who knows, but I'll see you around. And yeah, all right, I will see you later. Never forget how cool you are. You're special up here. You are special and you're never alone. And at some point I'm gonna figure out how to edit videos <laughs> or maybe get Sony Vegas again so I can actually you know piece stuff together. But for now, enjoy this little slappy no cut video and yeah, I'll see you later. Bye.